Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm just getting ready now for my last day of work. I'm currently in a hotel with my mom because my sublease ended a few days ago. So my mom's been here for work, so I've just been staying in her hotel because I don't really have a place to live. But today's my last day. I can't believe it. It literally went so fast. So I just figured I would take you guys through a day. I'm gonna vlog in the office today because I've, I've just been like scared to to get in trouble, but like I can't get in trouble now. So like, I'll show you guys a little bit of what like my desk looks like, especially now that it's all cleaned up. Um, and yeah, hopefully meet some of my friends. We'll see. I can't believe it's already been like 10 weeks or whatever it's been. Like it's crazy. It's flown by. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get ready now and drink my coffee. And uh, yeah, let's get this day going. A lot of you guys have been asking what makeup products I've been using, so I just decided I'll link them all in this video. Um, but basically, recently I've been combining two foundations, my Dior Forever one and this IT one because I feel like it gets my perfect shade because I'm kind of light right now. I haven't been self tanning as much. Now I'm doing eyeshadow. I can't believe it's already been 10 weeks. I know I keep saying that, but like I can't believe it's already time to go back to college. I feel like I just started. Time really does fly when you work. <laughs> So I want to hear from you guys too. Like, are you finishing up internships? Did you like it? Do you want to say hi to the vlog? I'm sure, but I have no makeup on. <laughs> you look good. Are you so joking? Annoying. Please. I'm ending my internship like a little bit earlier than everybody else because I go back to school literally next Wednesday and most other people don't start until like the 23rd or something. It's like the average day. So I literally have to go back to school. I'm already missing Rush for my sorority as it is, and I should be there because I'm on council, so I feel like I should be there. So, hard decisions. But when I'm home, I need a few days to like pack up my stuff, get my life together. Brooke, generally you don't put sneaker, you don't put like sneakers with a black bottom near white prop stuff. That's why I didn't put it here. I didn't put those there. Oh, I did? Yeah. Well, then maybe I put it in the corner and it moved. Okay. Giving yourself advice. Nice. Okay, but I'm gonna zip this. I just did all my makeup for work in 15 minutes. Woohoo! Since it's my last day of work, I picked up snacks for everybody veggie straws, pretzels, and my personal favorite gummies are probably Swedish fish, but then. I know everyone at work really likes these ones, and then I got Sour Patch. What? It's, what? I liked when you said that you had all the food groups. Oh yeah, because we have vegetables, fruits, fish, yep. <laughs> protein. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna grab my water, I'm quite thirsty. And we're driving to work, which is literally five minutes down the road. <laughs> I drive myself to work. This is odd circumstances, guys. Um, Your mommy is driving you to baby to work. <laughs> no, I do normally drive myself. Did you explain to them that you lease? Yes, yeah, so I said. We can all go around and say our favorite lunch order. <laughs> I'm a big fan of the. <laughs> I'm a big fan of the tofu at the summer. <laughs> we can go around and say your favorite memory from the summer. Oh my gosh, this is getting sentimental, guys. I'm tearing up. <laughs> Emo. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna eat my soup now. I have to show them the cat. No. All the fun snacks. This is such an engaging we content. It this morning. <laughs> Water in it is QVC oh. branded. Um, they I'm brought me. To think what codes I can give well, we thought they were gonna be donuts, and they were. <laughs> no, 
my Uber code. Bagels. So we, we got some bagels today and uh, I like the bagel. <laughs> it was a time. But there's plenty of snacks. My teeth actually hurt from the amount of gummies I've been eating the past few days. I'm really oh, concerned. Yeah. Like, that was like six I definitely want to revisit. Yeah, good so stuff. We have a 3 p.m. sharp trip to the This is what the cast the looks like. One more pan. <laughs> Here's me eating string cheese. Do, do your wrap. If you love string cheese, comment below. <laughs> is, that, is that what you said? I'll link this cheese below. <laughs> Yes. Avery's Alan. also trying Your to poison me. See. <laughs> I see how it goes. No, oh, shoot. I'm sorry, guys. No, it's okay. I just see how the it is. The peanut line is right <laughs> here. Really? <laughs> really? No peanut. That's a peanut hot take today. <laughs> Full salad bar. Oh, I love this. This is one of my favorite fridges up here at the Q. I get that hummus box. Oh, and then this is the Starbucks. Yeah, it's really cute. How beautiful. I love my work. <laughs> if you want to, you know, just watch QVC Japan. <laughs> we just took a walk downstairs. <laughs> and, oh, we actually started our experience here. And here. Yeah. We have this nice, it's very random. It's like a plain room and then like a nice like grass wall so if you ever want to take an IG pic <laughs> Hi guys, so I just wanted to hop on and properly conclude this vlog. I realized that I really didn't have a s ending because I ran from work to get on a train to New York and I'm home now. I also thought I would just sum up thoughts for my internship and stuff in this video because this whole video was like a day in my life. I hope you guys enjoyed it, showing you guys around and showing you my work friends and everything. Everybody is so sweet. Basically, I just wanted to sum up my thoughts in one video. Also, this is kind of interesting for me so that I can reflect on it someday. So obviously you don't have to keep watching if you're not interested. And like, I also just wrote my little notes in the mail, one to my manager and one to the girl who um, reached out to me on LinkedIn and like kind of somewhat recruited me for this internship so i just sent them thank you notes in the mail so concluding because it's saturday i literally finished yesterday it was so sad my last day like everyone was getting like sad and my coworkers were getting upset um i really i'm gonna miss them so much everybody on my team was so sweet overall i learned a lot this summer i learned that um corporate life is very interesting and um honestly i learned that a structure like that isn't for me but i feel like it's like that was such invaluable experience that i learned that like I don't want to spend every day of my life doing that work. There was nothing, there's no like tea or anything bad. It's just not the job for me. And I know I mentioned that in a QA. and a and honestly, I'm just being honest about it. Like, I'm just saying like, I just can't work in a structured job where it's like very much so like the same stuff every day and like the team puts out great stuff and everything is so, like they work so hard. They literally work such extreme hours, but it's just not for me. Trust me, I'm down to work long hours. I would consider myself to be like somewhat of a hardworking individual, not like a workaholic, but I'm like somewhere in the middle slash I like to work spectrum, but a structured job like that just isn't for me. I'm very like on the fly. Like I like to just do stuff. And even like my manager somewhat agreed with me. Like we had a meeting and I was like, I'm honestly not looking to get a job here. Like I just thought it would be great if I was honest with you. And he was like, yeah, like I totally get it. Like it's not really the personality fit for you. But my team was so awesome. Um, I really learned what it's like to do social media for like a big company and I learned a lot about Facebook live Which I found really cool because I think it's something that like I can integrate into like my own stuff But also I could use it um, You know if I was to ever work for a business like later in life I have such good like Facebook live experience, which is such a unique like skill set I feel like QVC goes Facebook live like all the time. So that was really cool I just kind of wish like this is just me being like nitpicky, but I, I learned so much, but I kind of wish that I was like utilized more. I know that an internship is an internship, but I just wish that I was able to like really leave my mark on the company. And I guess I didn't really get to do that. Obviously as an intern, like you don't get to like leave such a huge mark, but I like had a lot of great ideas and I suggested that they like begin a YouTube strategy because they don't have a YouTube strategy. And I'm like pretty good at that. I mean, I'm okay at it at least. And obviously that never came to fruition. I was only there for a few months. I can't expect it to, but um, I do have like great ideas for the company and I kind of wish that I was like able to be more heard out. But I guess that's like, you know, when you're an intern, it doesn't really work that way. So totally understandable. Like I get it. I'm literally the lowest man on the totem pole. Like that's the way it goes. To conclude, I think internships are 
really truly invaluable experience because you get to learn about yourself you get to learn about an industry and all before you are like in the regular workforce before you're like a full-time employee like i was a full-time employee but it was only over the summer it was a set period of time it was kind of like it was literally like a trial run of a job i have a whole theory on like paid versus unpaid internships because i've worked unpaid internships and sometimes it's not financially worth it, but this was a paid one, so it was definitely worth it to me. I also had to like pay for myself to stay in Westchester, so that was like a whole separate entity because I had to like pay rent and everything for the first time ever because my parents usually pay for my college rent, honestly, but I paid for this rent. That was like the first time I ever did that. So yeah, I just have a lot of thoughts on that. I mean, I'm not, once again, this is not me like looking to rest the company. This is just like my honest feedback and like looking forward where I'm looking to work in the future and stuff and yeah, I mean, it's a great corporation. There's a ton of opportunity. They have so many internships and jobs and I've gotten so many messages from you guys saying like, should I apply for a job there? Should I apply for an internship? Like I'm from the area, um, which a lot of you guys are from PA, which is crazy. So that's weird, <laughs> but I love you guys. That's awesome. So honestly, like, yes, if you think like a corporate fit is for you and you're looking to like kind of get started in a corporation, it's a great one because you can really work your way up if you're willing to like put in those hours and like grind and you think that like the stability of a corporate life is for you. I'm more of an on the fly kind of risky gal, so I'm willing to risk it and I don't think that fit is for me. But on that note, I'm really excited to see where life takes me and I think I have a lot ahead of me in seeing what I can do, what I can manage with YouTube, being a business major, kind of everything at once. So that's kind of it. I'm incredibly thankful for my experience. Like I think, like I said, it's so important to intern. And that's going to conclude this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. I'm kind of done with the intern videos, but if you like them, that was pretty cool. I mean, we're all going through this phase of life together. Like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just trying my best. And I think that that's the best that I can do as of right now. Thank you guys again for watching. I'm gonna miss my intern friends so much. Oh my gosh, I just thought about it. Cause like, I don't live in Philadelphia. And a lot of them go to school in Philly or are from Philly and like I'm not gonna see many of them again So that's sad, but hopefully, you know, our paths will cross one day and if any of them are watching this I love you guys and I miss you already I'm dressed because I'm gonna go out and socialize which I haven't been doing much socializing this summer because um, I didn't really have many friends in Pennsylvania So <laughs> taking advantage of socializing while I can here in New York a lot of you guys like comment and like ask me if I have friends and I'm like yes, I swear I have friends I just don't really show a lot of my social life because I'm still kind of awkward and like, I don't know, I'm kind of awkward with showing people on camera, you could probably tell from the clips today. I'm rambling, but thank you guys so much for watching this video and please subscribe if you're new. I'll talk to you in a future video, whatever. Bye guys.